What's up, everybody? It's your boy Slim Reactions back with another video, and Willie D gets clowned by Cat Williams on his own podcast. So, if you guys don't know who Willie D is, Willie D is a rapper out of you know he's he's a rapper from a, a group called Ghetto Boys. Uh, claimed that he wrote the Ghetto Boys some of the songs back in the day. Um, so uh, that's who Willie D is. He has a YouTube channel which. I'm actually subscribed to. I actually love Pause. I like Willie D's channel. I've been listening to his channel for years. The man gives amazing, amazing information when it comes to certain things. Man, I mean, just an amazing interview. Just real, I mean, not interview, just amazing channel overall. When he, he covers a range of different topics, and I really appreciate that. Subscribe to him, been subscribed to him for years, but... People are going in on Willie D saying he is clout chasing. Okay, they saying, bruh. So, if you guys don't know, you're Shannon Sharp. Uh, Shannon Sharp, he, you know, made history with uh, Cat Williams. Uh, you know, uh, you you know, he made, I want to say history, but uh, he made, uh, he went viral for his uh, show called Club Shay Shay on um, on, uh, Instagram, right, I'm trying to find a picture with him, where he ain't all, with the shirt off and all this, there. hold on, god damn, nigga, I ain't gonna lie, I'm just hating, <laughs> okay, I'm hating, anyway, <laughs> yo, can we give a few seconds to hate on this nigga real quick, <laughs> I'm hating, all right, my bad, my body ain't like he is, pause, anyway, so, really the, so, anyway, Shannon Sharp goes completely viral within a day with Cat Williams. Their interview, uh, uh, Cat Williams exposed a lot of celebrities. He went in on a lot of celebrities. And, uh, you know, his videos had reached over, like, 50 million views within, like, a few days or whatever, like a day or something like that. Now, Willie D is saying, hey, my interview with Cat Williams was done since last year, months prior, but Willie D held on to, Willie D held on to the, uh, on to the interview, right? So Willie D held on to the interview for months, and Willie D said that he was going to put it on some new type of platform, and to let that be the new, let that interview be the new rollout, right? But, uh, yeah, it didn't, it didn't quite, you know, I guess since the Shannon Sharp interview got put out and he saw the numbers, that's when Willie D was like, oh shit, these numbers are popping. Hey man, let me go ahead and drop mine, which, which is smart, right? Because now his views are sitting at like three something million. No, excuse me. His views are sitting at like, like at five million. Now, of course it didn't have that same effect like the Shannon Sharp interview with Club Shay Shay did, right? Because you know, it's a different dynamic. It's a different style of interviewing, right? Um, uh, so, you know, it, it didn't, of course, it's not going to hit the same way, right? I watched a little bit of the interview last week. Um, I, I, I couldn't get all the way into it because it's just like, you know, it, it was, my opinion, it was the same old questions. It was, you know, it, I'm, my thinking was, I'm like, well, we just had the interview last week with Shannon Sharp asking the que the same questions Willie no well, Willie D asking the same question Shannon Sharp did right. So my opinion it was like well it's the same old shit right. It's the same questions. The people only went there because they wanted to hear Cat Williams go off. But you're not gonna. I forgot what that saying is. You're not going to strike gold twice, right? Whatever the saying is, right? You're not going to hit it the way Shannon Sharp hit it. Pause, okay? Um. So, Willie D, you know, he, he made five, you know, he, he hit five million off the video. You know, Um. and P, I watched the comments, man. People were going in saying, yo, this is, yo, you whack for this. Um. They were saying, yo, you know, you just trying to copy what, Shannon Sharp was doing. You need to stop. <laughs> you need to stop. You need to stop. This is stupid. Why are you? We, this is the same questions we already heard. 
you a goofball, you know, just all sorts of stuff, right? And so Willie D claps back at the people who were saying that, saying, look, the interview was done months before Shannon Sharp did. Y'all would do the same thing. Y'all would put out the same type of same. If y'all was in my position, y'all would stop hating. Y'all just hate us. Uh, and, you, and you won't do nothing to me. You won't see me. That type of stuff, right? So let me know what you guys think, man. If you even care about this at all. <laughs> I know a lot of stuff is going on right now. We got Yo Gotti, brother, Big Jook. He got slain yesterday. Um, I don't know if anybody. This is this is last week or whatever. I just saw it. So, um, you know, I, I just want to know what you guys' opinion is. You know, Willie D. It to me, the interview was kind of. It's like, okay, I watched the Shannon Sharp interview, right? And it was like, boom, 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 Cat Williams, boom, boom, boom. It was just a great dynamic. Then you see Willie D do it. It's like, uh, come on, bruh. <laughs> I understand why he do it because you got to get them views, right? Hey, hey, Cat Williams is popping right now. Hey, if everybody can bring him onto the platform, everybody will do it, right? So, you know. But people wasn't feeling it. Let me know if you, let me know in the comments what you guys think. Leave a comment. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, and I will catch you guys on the next video. Peace.